I'm a full-time nurse. I also work part-time as a nurse on top of that as well. And then I am a bar and Pilates instructor. I was very busy. Um, prior to this was running marathons and very active. I love to snowboard and um, try to get outside as much as possible. I was out running and I was noticing that I was having this like severe chest pain feeling. I started getting these abnormal symptoms, so I brought myself into emergency. Um, I had the kind of classic chest tightening, palpitations, a ton of stabbing, severe chest pain. cardiac symptoms and the chest pain was awful and had severely impacted my life but more than any of the physical stuff it was the mental impact it was so hard to um, kind of doubt myself I trusted my gut that something was wrong I knew something didn't feel right just being repeatedly told that there's nothing wrong was really challenging During the coronary angiogram, if we don't find any blockages, we can use this device. This is attached to a tiny wire that goes into the heart arteries that is able to give us that information very quickly. We found that many patients, female patients with chest pain, were often said, okay, well, this is not cardiac. Uh, they're often put on anti-anxiety medications, antidepressant medications, and we're now learning that their physiology is real due to this technology. And so because of that, to be able to provide answers to patients is a tremendous relief. I actually started crying in, at, at the procedure when they had given this diagnosis. I started crying and they were like, oh no, and I was like, no, I'm so grateful to have an answer. This is, these are happy tears. To have the specialized testing even here available in Edmonton, I, I just truly feel so grateful for it.